Um, polymute. P P Polybius? What? Polymute. Let's, uh, check it out. Alrighty. Let's do it. You got kind of a weird aspect ratio going on. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I wonder if it's was designed for phones. It's kind of got that vertical phone look to it, but doesn't mm. really seem like a phone game. A pretty fat phone. That's true. More yeah, like a, a tablet. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Uh. It might be emulating some old computer game or something, but I wouldn't know. Yeah, maybe. Uh, welcome to the game. Use right mouse to move. Alrighty. Welcome to the game. <laughs> <laughs> Use the mouse wheel or Q and E to select an action. Okay. You examine yourself. <laughs> You examine a tree, you learn its form. Oh, and then you turn into it? You can turn into it. You get, um you have to hit middle click middle mouse or tab and it'll go to your forms menu and you can scroll up and down. And you can find your forms that you've learned. And then uh you pick your form, you get out of there, either middle, middle mouse or tab to get out of it and then you can transform. So what the fuck was the point of that? <laughs> well, I I think there's there's puzzles. I mean, you might not be able to solve a puzzle by turning into a tree, but you know, I, I assume you turn into things to solve various puzzles <laughs> or something. Alrighty. You examine a worm. <laughs> oh, did you find a worm? Yeah, near the books. Okay. Oh, all right. <laughs> I'm a worm. Oh my god. After you get past the worm, you just like spinning in place. Yeah, I saw that. I guess you uh, blew him the fuck out. <laughs> yeah. Damn, this worm is fast. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm just examining everything a mushroom, a rock, and a lock and what the fuck <laughs> yeah I'm gonna turn into all this shit <laughs> yeah maybe I mean you can I wish it told you what the things are in your list of transmorphs right yeah because once the it, you're looking at them in isolation. I, I can't tell what the hell half these things are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Frog just smuggled me across the river. Nice job. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Sometimes it's a little hard maneuvering. Get yeah. stuck on stuff. Yeah, for sure. Well, I guess I didn't try it. Can you use arrow? No. Waz? No. Did you know you can change the HUD color? Just press the 1 through 9 keys to switch it up. Hmm. You can also change forms in water. However, you... Oh, wait. Maybe you can't. Uh, oh man, there's too much shit. There's too much manual to read. Holy fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, bro. Switching my HUD. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Damn, it's <this is> trippy. <laughs> Did anything in particular attract you to this game over the other ones? The, um,. Visual style was definitely uh, interesting. Didn't really look like anything I'd seen or played before. Mm -hmm. There's a, I'm trying to think of a game. I think Rare made a game. It was called like um, 
Night something. I think it was an arcade game. And it had this, like, a similar, like, palette. Um, like, very low amount of colors. Mm -hmm. Um, but it's, it kind of reminded me of that. But, uh, this, I mean, it's probably way different gameplay. I think it's, like, just, like, a, you know, arcade platformer or something, you know, some, some kind of action game. Is that game that Rare made, is that an old game? It's an older game, yeah. Um, what was it called? Nightmare? Like K-N-I-J-G-H-T Mare, maybe? Um, that might have been the name. Mm. But yeah, it's an older game. I think it was on, uh, it was in Rare Replay, the collection of Rare games that came out on like Xbox 360 at some point. Jesus, yeah, there's a whole bunch of shit in the library books here like potion potion recipes yeah this, this world oh my god it really did open up after that that demon <laughs> yeah it's kind of overwhelming how many characters there are to talk to and to get the form of and holy shit bro damn i know I guess though it is a, a premium game, so you got that premium game scope. Yeah. It's value right there. <laughs> but by the same token, that probably means we aren't gonna get too far tonight. But what we have seen I'm really digging. It's pretty interesting, but I probably want to restart it and pay more attention to stuff along the way and keep record of where stuff is. Because I, yeah. fe I fell down a hole and now I just have no idea how to get back to that blue dungeon we oh, both shit. started in. <laughs> God, I really do wish there was a, a hover tooltip for these objects to tell you what they are. There's just so many just blobs of God knows what and I can't... I don't know what the yeah. fuck it is. <laughs> it, really, it really is. Like, they could, they could put that on the at the bottom window like you could put the name of the thing that you're looking at or clicking on exactly where your your text box usually is just make that a tooltip yeah. hover yeah for sure i got the my arc form at least oh thank god you got the my arc nice you are saved bro <laughs> nice yeah uh, the skull's stuck in this game too. He's like, I'm trying to read the manual, but uh, I'm I'm stuck in the library. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah, I found the hole you're talking about. <laughs> well, try falling in, I guess. Oh, don't do it, bruh. Don't do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm wondering what this hue in the bottom right does. Mm hmm. It's not associated with the uh, HUD hue. It seems like it's a uh, if you if you press tab it um it looks like you have a list of hues so I assume at some point you're gonna be able to change your hue. Oh, shit. that's gonna do do something. Looks like you have ingredients and other items and boots. Yeah. Oh, shit! Damn, bro! Damn! Holy fuck! Yeah. Jeez. Yeah, these premium games aren't really suited to our 40 minutes-ish uh, format. Yeah, in some ways. I mean, it's, it's different than our usual fare. We're, we're really just um, checking out the intro or, you know, the, just the basics of these games um, for the time being. Um, yeah. Um, Bro, there's a snake and a snake statue. What the shit? <laughs> but, uh, pretty clever and creative. Yeah. <laughs> I just got ganged up on by a group of snakes and they were attacking me. I go behind the corner, turn into a snake, and now they're uh, friendly. <laughs> oh, nice. Ah, comrade, welcome to our home. <laughs> <laughs> I also like the term 
Gemerald. <laughs> I do like that as well, yeah. We examine a nose. Bro, what the fuck? Oh, it's... Oh, what the... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I like traveling around as the snake and worm, just inching around. <laughs> <laughs> Another quality of life thing that would be nice is if the last dialogue page would be followed up by just a blank text box so you know that you finished the conversation. For sure, yeah. You just kind of you just keep keep going until you see the intro piece of dialogue again. Yeah. Plus I'm just mashing buttons and wanna get through it. <laughs> I don't care what they're saying. I don't give a fuck, bro. Damn. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, I bet you regret jumping down that hole now, don't you? Uh, well, no, I think I saw most of what I could find in the other place. I feel like I explored a lot of the stuff up there. So I'm perfectly happy down here. lighting fuses for bombs it's pretty cool <laughs> but I'm not sure what I did oh maybe, maybe I can go in the pipe as a worm can I? <laughs> the pipe as a worm <laughs> oh, I thought you could maybe not no Ooh, you, you need the turret for <laughs> <laughs> oh man I knew I needed something can't you just examine the ground and you're like examining the earth and then you can take the form of the earth <laughs> <laughs> I mean yeah <laughs> monster kitchen <laughs> yeah there's a puddle cauldron some more books a mon chef like a monster chef <laughs> a bit of herb, bit of salt, bit of grime, bit of malt. Human skull, extra taste, weeds, flesh, and a paste. What? Pearl, <laughs> pergle, maybe two. Now that is a tasty brew. Bit of herb, bit of salt. Oh, wait. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> Rainbow potions make users change color at random, but chameleon steel lets the user change color at will. Okay, so you need chameleon stew to change your color or something. Uh, wh why would you change your color? I don't know. <laughs> I, I didn't, it didn't give me that that uh reason or whatever. Hey, hey, outsider, you've stumbled into green territory. You better get out of here if you know what's good for you. <laughs> <laughs> this is a green only zone. <laughs> You transform into a skeleton doot. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> it's a Mr. Skeletal reference. Holy shit. Oh my god. Transform into an elephant. Toot toot. Into <laughs> an elephant. <laughs> <laughs> Why is all this shit down here? Why is there an elephant down here? I don't know. Oh, that's a pretty good elephant. Yeah. It's like a little baby elephant. A pink elephant. <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck, bro. Fuck. The shit is crazy. Yeah, shit, bro. Damn. This is too hard. You need to think and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Shit. Well, luckily our last game, I think, is uh, low on the thinking. So. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's why I planned out that way. All right. Well, that's welcome since, uh... Damn. Sako yeah. Loco fucked my brain up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, same. Uh, can we save it? I don't know. Maybe not. Oh, I think 
I just pressed escape and if I click continue it puts me right back where I was. So I guess that might be uh, saving? Okay. Maybe, I don't know. It might just be a pause menu and if I click end game and... <laughs> well, let well. me see. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it did save. Nice. Okay. Exact, awesome. exact spot. Very nice. Big ups. That's some good saving technology right there. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah, we'll have to come back to that one at some point. Yeah, pretty cool. But way too in-depth to get too far tonight. <laughs> mm -hmm, for sure. What was that tagline? <laughs> a game about changing or something like that? <laughs> yeah. A game about changing. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it was not lying. But <laughs> a game about changing. <laughs> I feel like that could be spiced up a little bit. Yeah, maybe. But maybe it's, you know, maybe there's other themes of change going on too you know there might be multiple meanings you know changing your color yeah changing, changing your, your your um changing the world you know changing your perspective or something you know i don't know if it, i don't know if any of this is true <laughs> i was trying to think of something you know that would uh change. make that a stronger tagline Changing uh, your underwear. <laughs> oh, shit. I need to do that after Soko Loco. <laughs> Pants shittingly <laughs> infuriating. <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, shit. Maybe we should change games. I got them. Oh, that's a hell of a segue. Yeah. No, but that was really good. Really fun and really creative, too. And I give it Polly out of mute. Bruh. Yeah. Yo. yeah, I totally didn't just take the title and... <laughs> <laughs> Make it a score. 